Hi guys and good morning. Um, I'm finishing up the, the video we started yesterday. Sorry about that. And you can see where that glue has dried. And you see a few spots where it's kind of sparse. So this afternoon I'll go back in and redo that. But for the sake of the video, I just wanted to show you how it looks when it's painted. And I may... Let's see what happens if it doesn't move. Yeah, I'll I'll um I'll paint it because I'm filming again one-handed, but I'll be right back once we get the paint done. Okay, so <clears throat> if you look, you get it forever to focus here, but you can kind of see it doesn't look flat. There's kind of a an edge to it. So it almost looks, and this is, you know, a lot of this is the paint is still wet. But then you look at the bottom. You see the difference? It's just kind of a a flat back. Flat black. I did that just so for the comparison's sake. You can kind of see the difference. Where that looks more metal. And then there's the bottom. Flat black. No oomph, no shine, no anything, and then the front. And if you could see it in real life, you would realize it how much, just how much difference it makes. So what's going to happen is then when I do these back pieces, I have a um, a three dimensional paint that I might go in and do those these little pieces with, and maybe those. I'm not sure yet. I want it to look, you know, I want it to pop out, to shine, to show up. So that's what it looks like painted. And then I'll go back in, like I said, this afternoon. I'll clean it up, and once all that's dry, I'll take a little piece of uh, sandpaper, and I'll sand the inner parts of those grates and repaint those. And I'll show it to you again. And then here on this piece, it's got quite a buckle to it, so what I'm going to have to do is go in and straighten that up. Make sure that's level. Okay, so that is the great painted, guys. And so anytime you want to do metal, whoops, sorry. Anytime you want to do metal, that's the best, or make it look more metallic, that's the best way to do it. And it works great. And like I said, I've I, I, I seen Aira Bentley do this, and then it, I saw um, Thick It Works. Heather from Thicket Works, and she no longer has a YouTube, bless her heart. She was one of the coolest. She did a, uh, like, gothic stuff, and it was really cool. In fact, well, you'll see some of her um, cricket cuts in, in some of my stuff. So there you go, guys. All right, thanks for watching.